An annual cycling event in Ottawa is giving visually impaired people a glimpse of hope. The sixth annual Cycle for Sight was held in CARP today. It brought together people from across the city, including one mother with her eyes set on finding a cure for her 10-year-old son. Camille Karamali has more. For Angela Cowie, the Cycle for Sight ride is one event she looks forward to every year. It's a cause that's close to her heart. Her son Gabriel is visually impaired. He doesn't see peripherally at all, um, and he has patches of his central vision that are affected as well, so he has actual blank spots in his vision. The disease is called retinitis pigmentosa. Odds are Gabriel's vision will slowly continue to deteriorate as he gets older, unless there's a cure. I love Gabriel so much and I think he just, I would really like for him to ride, drive a car someday. He's really, he loves, he loves cars. Yeah, if they come with a cure, I really hope they do so and then I can drive one day. Nearly 80 cyclists rode up to 100 kilometers to raise money for that cause. Some of the riders were visually impaired. Nicole Hill is one of them. Thanks to a tandem bike and a friend to act as her eyes, she got to do something new. I got to tell you, it was a really exhilarating experience. I, I can, you know, I never understood cycling enthusiasts until I got involved in this particular ride. And if I were fully sighted, I'd be out there with the best of them. <laughs> I really would. This year's event raised more than $80,000 with all funds going to the Foundation Fighting Blindness. Organizers say they plan on holding another cycle for sight this time next year. Camille Karamali, CBC News, Ottawa.